Hi, my name is David Dubor, and I'm going to read Proverbs 6. My son, don't put up money for what your neighbor owes. Don't agree to pay up for someone else. Don't be trapped by what you have said. Don't be caught by the words of your mouth. Instead, my son, do something to free yourself. Don't fall into your neighbor's hands. Don't be proud. Hurry and make your appeal to your neighbor. Don't let your eyes go to sleep. Don't let your eyelids close. As the deer frees itself from a hunter, free yourself. As the bird frees it, bird frees, frees itself from a trapper, free yourself. You people who don't want to work, think about the ant. Consider its ways and be wise. It has no commander. It has no leader or ruler. But it stores up its food in the summer. It gathers its food at harvest time. You lazy people, how long will you lie there? When will you get up from your sleep? You might sleep a little or take a little nap. You might even fold your hands and rest. Then you would be poor as if someone had robbed you. You would have little as if someone had stolen from you. A worthless and evil man goes around saying twisted things with his mouth. He winks with his eyes. He makes signals with his feet. He motions with his fingers. His plans are evil. He has lies in his heart. He is always stirring up with fights. Trouble will always catch up with him in an instant. He will suddenly be destroyed. Nothing can save him. There are six things the Lord hates. In fact, he hates seven things. The Lord hates proud eyes, a lying tongue, and hands that kill those who aren't guilty. He also hates hearts that make evil plan, feet that are quick to do evil, any witness who pours out lies, and, and anyone who stirs up family fights. My son, keep your father's commands. Don't turn away from your mother's teachings. Tie them to your heart forever. Put them around your neck. When you walk, they will guide you. When you sleep, they will watch over you. When you wake up, they will speak to you. Your father's commands are like a lamp. Your mother's teaching is like a light. And the training that corrects you leads to life. It keeps you from a sinful woman. It keeps you from the, sm from the smooth tongue of a woman who commits adultery. Don't hunger in your heart after her beauty. Don't let her eyes capture you. A prostitute leaves you with only a loaf of bread. Another man's wife hunts your very life. You can't shovel fire into your lap without burning your clothes. You can't walk on hot coals without burning your feet. It's the same for anyone who has sex with another man's wife. Anyone who touches her will be punished. People don't hate a thief who steals to fill his empty stomach. But when he is caught, he must pay seven times as much as he stole. It may even cost him everything he has. A man who commits adultery has no sense. Anyone who does it destroys himself. He will be beaten up and dishonored. His shame will never be wiped away. Jealousy stirs up a husband's anger. He will show no mercy when he gets even. He won't accept any payment. He won't take any money, no matter how much he is offered. Thanks for watching. God bless you. Have a nice day. Bye.